Once the machine has calibrated and your client's mask is fitted, connect the VO2 hose to the air intake valve. Have your client relax and breathe normally through the mask and hose. Once the cardio coach is filled with expired air and receiving a steady heart rate signal, it will begin to count down from 1 minute and 30 seconds. Allow the countdown to complete. Do not start exercising until the countdown is finished. When the countdown is complete, you will be prompted to start testing. Press the check or enter key on the cardio coach and start the treadmill or bike simultaneously. Start your client at a lower speed or resistance, increasing their workload gradually throughout the test to slowly see their heart rate and VO2 increasing. If the client begins to feel pain at any time or needs to stop the test for any reason, simply press the enter key and begin the heart rate recovery process. Be sure to communicate regularly with your client to make sure they're doing okay. This test will usually last about 7 to 15 minutes depending on how conditioned your client is and the protocol being used. During the course of the test, you will want to follow a protocol that increases workload in regular intervals. Increasing the workload on a treadmill might include changing the incline or speed, whereas increasing the workload on a bike might include an increase in resistance. For example, you could run a protocol that increases the speed or incline of a treadmill in one minute intervals during the course of a test. With this protocol, the client would reach their anaerobic threshold around minute seven or eight. Once the client reaches their anaerobic threshold, AT detected will appear on the LCD screen. To complete a submax test, continue the protocol at least one to two minutes until the client is ready to end the test. At that point, you will hit stop on the bike or treadmill and press the enter key on the cardio coach. This will end the test and begin the heart rate recovery process, which lasts about two minutes. On the cardio coach, you will see a prompt asking if you would like to begin the recovery from now or peak. Selecting peak will start the two-minute countdown from the moment the client reached their peak measurement. Now that the test is complete, you can print the results and review them with your client.